IMT Conversations with Ron Texon. Ron Texon. An incisive and sharp discussion of today's current issues. Ang pagpadayon sa duwa ka dekada ng serbisyo publiko. IMT Conversations with Ron Texon. Philippines Mayong Hapon. Welcome sa IMT Conversation. My name is Rod Texon and live. Kaupon naton ang, uh, ang kandidata sa probinsya sa Gi uh, Gimaras sa Miss Universe sa Philippines pageant. Uh, si uh, Vanessa, Miss uh, Vanessa Che Wing. Ibaloon ta kung kamusta na ang uh, mga activities dito karon sa bayan sa Metro Manila leading to the uh, finals night comes May uh, of uh, this year. Vanessa, may hapon. Hello everyone, may hapon sa tanan. Uh, especially sa mga Ilonggos, kag mga Gimaras noon, especially nga nagaba, ganang tao no, kag pamatis ko sa atin. So, hello everyone from from the beautiful city of Makati. <laughs> Since we are now starting with our activity, so I am staying here for good for the next two months. Of course, this will be the first interview sa uh, IMT, ang Ilo Ilo Metropolitan Times sa IMO. Uh, siguro, it would be better if uh, kilala ko natin anay si Vanessa. No? Uh, paano ikaw uh, na kasulod sa bayan sa Miss Universe pageant? And uh, you know what? Madamo sa nagambal. Kagawa pa sa iya, kanami sa iya. Pero doon ay ko nagkakita sa iya sa mga Miss uh, Iloilo. Hindi uh, ni siya nag-agi ng competition. Uh, please enlighten us, Vanessa. Yeah, so I am actually quite into pageantry ever since I was 16 years old. I started joining pageants when I was 16 and I won my first pageant. So ever since where it made me realize that I'm into pageantry and I have the beauty and also I have the the brains to do it. So nagsigisigi siya no from as uh, since uh, when I was 16 years old. No sigisigi intra ko pageants. I joined Miss Black and White and then Miss Silka. So, mga first pageants ko medyo pang tini-tini lang anay, more on like skin-skin lang. And then eventually I joined um, Miss Parao Regatta and then I was crowned man with that pageant. And then, um, naka-intram ko ibang nga pageants, no? So, um, with that, parang nag-take man ako rest from pageantry because I focus sa akong profession. No, as a public servant, no, I work with government. I work with National Irrigation Administration for uh, almost six years, and then I work with DA and um, um one year, actually one year na ko this month sa DA. So as a consultant, so uh, medyo nag focus ako ane sa kung career. Uh, since that is really my profession, I graduated Bachelor of Science in Environmental Management. So. Um, kumbaga ang ginis siya ako in the field so uh, I concentrate on my work and I stop joining pageants and modeling and then also because my, my um, schedule got so busy because I was also requested by Central Philippine University to part-time teach students with environmental science subjects so I'm also a part-time instructor so parang na, na consume na ako nga time with my work and also my other um, uh, side jobs to para ako na. So, parang wala na ko gawa, nag, uh, nagka-interest into pageantry, but sang nag-announce sa Miss Universe na there's no height limit because amugin ang always ang, ang limitations, no? amugin ang for me, nag-discourage ako mag-join pageants because of my height. I'm only 5'3", 5'4", tira tira, depende kisa sa, sa amount of stretching yung ginobla ko that day. But, um, so since nag-post ang Miss Universe na there's no height limit and mga, kumbaga, they are very into, um, kumbaga, they're looking for a phenomenal woman who can like sh uh, share her advocacy, her story that could touch so many people. But it inspired me to join because I feel like um, I can I can share and I can tell so much about my profession and uh, my experiences with farmers, with with the agricultural industry and environmental sustainability. So, parang amo na nag, nag inspire sa akin to join this time. So, that's it. So, Bali, uh, instead of joining, 
sadyan diri sa Iloilo, you went uh, straight uh, sa, uh, how do you call it, El eliminations, adira sa Manila, and uh, th that is where you made the top 40. Yeah, so I personally uh, went to Manila to screen. To screening, my, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, screening to submit personally my requirements. And mm -hmm. then after that, I got a call back. Mm -hmm. And then that's it. Okay. And uh, the rest was uh, history. And now uh, yes. people are asking, did you go to Yes, uh, I have actually roots from Buena Vista mm -hmm. my, and my father's side. Mm -hmm. Uh, he has cousins there, mm -hmm. and then uh, my mother naman has um, uh, cousins but also in, I think, San Lorenzo. Uh -huh. so they have like farm there. So, so hindi madula sa imo ang dugo sa pagkagimaras uh, nun? Plus, yes. the fact nga ang uh, imo trabaho as consultant sa PRDP, ara nakatotok subong sa probinsya sa Gimaras. So, daw ka... Yes. Time ligid and tanan, and now you are representing the province of uh, Gimaras. Moving forward, Vanessa, kamo sa subong ang mga pre-pageant uh, activities dira sa bayan sa uh, Metro Manila. So uh, this week we're actually focused sa mga sponsorship shoots ng no? sa mga sponsors. Mm -hmm. So um, it's more on like photo shoots and creating contents no for our major sponsors, and also workshops no. Uh, we have per batch na ano mga workshops so basically there are times na hindi nyo kumakitaan because per batch ha. so like for example with our training sa walk and sa Q&A uh, I'm usually batch to you know, since most of the time alphabetical siya so usually second day ako sa muna so like tomorrow I have workshops in my walk so basically more on preparatory activities pa lang right now uh -huh. so wala pa wala pa sa mga major activities uh, related to uh, the uh, Miss uh, Universe pageant or moving forward sa uh, pageant itself. But of course, in itanan mga preparations, like uh, your walk is being uh, uh, um, facilitated through a workshop. When you say walk, uh, amo ining manners ang paglakat mo. When you say Q&A, yeah. amo ining pinaka-importante is tanan. Kay usually, diri gakasimplang ang mga kandidata eh, sa Q&A. Um, nami magambal, nami magistorya na unahan karon sang dungan sang pamangkot disgrasya gid ayon so uh, ati sa kalawigon na kag uh, budlay ko nang maestra kay ang maestra babaan gid ya so do wala kita di hadlock no indi lang magtiraksanay ni uh, may bato gid ang uh, gimaras for the uh, miss universe uh, pa title hopefully hopefully sir Rod, because uh -huh. um Ang subong gina pagita gin nila yung someone who can like share her story and is like not afraid to ano uh, kung share and fight her advocacy so feel ko do makaya gin no with with their proper training man ka ano man actually it's more on like effort man and like practice because uh, it takes practice gin para ma almost ma perfect ang tanan so me and my team are very focused man with the Q and A not just the parts the the walk no kay te ang sa walk may mga may mga workshops man nga ginaprovide but with the Q&A uh though medyo good like it because may my pressure my my audience my you know it's really a mental a mental preparedness it's a Q&A so um, ang ginasya ang mga ginapreparahan it's a Q&A so okay uh na notice ko Vanessa you know um, um, I uh, I am lucky no to have uh, joined your journey bisan pa pano katatlo ka adlaw ko ikaw nga gintulok gid uh, halos uh, 8 hours a day tinakana ko na si itsura mo um, pero nakibot ako sang transformation daw hindi ikaw ang ginalantaw ko subong daw beauty queen ang get up mo subong uh, nadula na si Vanessa ng uh, the cute one di ba ne um, ang makita mo subong is Vanessa the Beauty Queen. Um, is this part of the transformation provided for by Miss Universe or this is a local one? Um, we're actually playing with the looks. So, mm -hmm. so we're trying to do different hairstyles and like they're also trying sometimes to make me tan or like to to change my hair color, to change the eyeshadow, the, the eyebrows, just to see what fits me best na classy makeup and styling. So, of course, I have still with me my my, my team, ang mga stylist ko. 
So, amo na. So, kung kisa wala kami ubrahon, no, aside from training sa Q&A and walk, we play with our looks para at least, no, we see what's best. So, do amo na siya sa grab. I see. <laughs> That's why siguro medyo subong doon na-realize na mo na namin mangalis ako ng banat and with like, uh-huh. uh, you know, like very clean look. So, do amo na siya. <laughs> Sino ka na ini ang, uh, ang asawa ni Pan Philaxona? I'm not sure. <laughs> Me? Ang asawa bala ni si Judy Santa Maria. Ah, Judy Santa Maria. Uh, ginalanta ko sa siling ko si Banay Sagid Mani o si Judy. No? Uh, grabe ang pag-transform. No? Grabe ang pag-transform. You, you are now into the beauty queen uh, titlist level. Ano nga title ina? Amo pa ng bantayan ta. No? Um, we are actually monitoring every day and checking from time to time updates and uh, makita naton kung ano ang lain. No? Ano ang lain sa imo nga beauty compared sa iban. Of course, ang problema o galing, hindi lang ni pagpagwapa. Hindi lang ni galing mat- mystery sa mata. No? Hindi lang ni galing sa smile. Um, this will all boil down sa overall of being a woman, including the mind. No, ano lang sa gwapa ko, medyo hindi man nami ang uh, imo sining uh, pag-insendi sa pila ka mga butang. So point lang, let me ask you, what is your take sa pagpatay uh, sa sulod sa balay niya mismo sa kay uh, Governor Digamos ang Negros Oriental? Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Loud lang. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> I'm joking. Uh, gusto ko lang ipahibalo sa imo nga I am certain ina isa sa mga pamangkot niyo magwa sa palaabuton niyo mayo. But anyhow, so sa sininga, sa sininga punto, uh, Vanessa, uh, kung i-rate mong imo ko galingon, more or less from from here, nga nagaling ka sa Iloilo, hasta nga nag-abot ikaw dira, hasta nga nakasugod ka na sa mga pre pageant activities um, uh, if we talk of 100% preparations sa diin ka na subo ng porsyento ng level I feel like right now I'm in like around 80 80 so like 85 siguro oh. 85 yeah mm-hmm. I feel like there's still so much more to learn and mm-hmm. to improve with myself mm-hmm. but I feel like ever since na I was like back in Iloilo parang siguro when I was in Iloilo mga 60% mm-hmm. <laughs> because so, um that time when I was in Lilo preparing for like my tourism video and like the things I need to bring in Manila, you know, the people I have to bring with me. Parang over uh collectively parang it affected me somehow and mm-hmm. it made me parang like ay kabud lai gali no like hindi siya gali hapos because mm-hmm. I have to consider so many things, so many people, the one of their feelings, things mm-hmm. like that. So it made me quite um, conscious about myself. Mm-hmm. But like when I was like here na in Manila, and then like some of my teams were were able to go back na si Lilo, and it's more of like me and like my, the closest people in, in my life na na nabilibili sa Manila right now. Parang do naka do nag ano na do nag clear up on mind, and I was able to really concentrate on the things that is more important kan tapat ko concentrate eh, concentrate so it made me ano more focused and um yeah more focused sa dapat ko i-achieve yeah. I-, i feel like uh, it's a long way pa but uh, I- i'm getting there because amatamat gaka gaka ano ko na siya gaka kita ko na ko ano kita pa tang dapat improve ko sa self ko and yeah. the things that needs to be worked yeah i know you shed a lot of tears but uh, you know, yeah. ang uh, luha abikin ang lano nato yun kay isa before kita makasmile. So that's a requirement. Ang stress ng inagyan mo uh, kinan lano ginaya before mo attain ang peace of mind because you cannot appreciate white kung wala mo nakita ang darkness. So always remember that. Now uh, the, the thing is, the thing is, uh, uh, it's we are happy na mabatian na uh, uh, you are eighty percent. Kaya kabud lagi ni karon kung mag 100% ang sabat mo. No? There's no room for you to improve. Kahit 100% ka na. But when you say 80% ka pa lang as of this time, amat-amata lang. Lawig pa ni ang Mayo, no? Lawig pa ang uh... Saan ang exact nga pageant day? The coronation night will be on May 13. May 13. So but silingon, dira ka na gid stay until May 13. Yes. Um we have like Ano lang siguro, vacation, mga one-week vacation mm-hmm. sa Holy Week. So, I see. 
Uh-huh. Uh, I will go back to Iloilo, but still working with my mom and dad. One foods, moment. Looks, uh-huh. Foods na kana ni prepare. Uh-huh. But Indi- amo in- na siya. So amo na siyang pawai na mo because the rest of the weeks will be more on like workshops and shoots. Kidia so very see. busy. Then sometimes I feel like how oh, bad. Mm-hmm. I do like do like uh, like hindi siya gili hapos. Like it's not easy to be a beauty queen. Mm-hmm. Uh, some people would think like they have to just like look good in camera and like walk the best the best way they could but actually it's more than that mm-hmm. it takes so much of like pressure and to yeah pressure get to actually sa pagstay sa Manila most of the time I didn't feel like really super happy with mm-hmm. everything especially with the bashers mm-hmm. that's why I don't check social media anymore mm-hmm. starting nag post ng Miss Universe sa mga pictures na because although wala man negative kid, but you can uh, you can feel like you're being watched all the time so yeah you know uh, pressured all the time Oh, oh, there's there's nothing wrong. Uh, always uh, always look at uh, everything on the right side and on the good side. Um, perhaps they are bashing you because they saw something. Perhaps they're bashing you because they don't know anything at all. So do not be afraid. Kiti um, kalawa na kalonya ka gakabalaka ikaw. But what is important is uh, asilim mo ganik na you have regained composure. You have regained focus. So matamat lang ah, no? Hindi pagulpia, hindi paginga gawang 100%. Show it on the talent on the day on May 13 and. Uh, well, we're hoping to to uh, invite you on the 19th or 20th or 21st or the 22nd dito sa Manggaan Festival. Uh, dapat makao na tas ang paho nga wala ka na ginapunggan. Wala ka na ginahambalan. Hinay-hinaya lang, hindi paghamala. No? Uh, <laughs> so... We hope that tanan yun ay magbunga dera sa imo sa Metro Manila. If there is there is any wish nga gusto mo subong ihambal back home ano ina? I wish for I, I wish for everyone's not just siguro support but like at least uh, appreciation siguro. <laughs> um, with especially from like sa mga gimaras mo because I feel like. That inspires me. Whenever I read something like "Pas Pas Gimaras" or like "Go Gimaras, we got this," something like that, parang it inspires me to do better and to to not be sad and to be motivated uh, to really get the crown because I feel like kaya gitya to get the crown. But uh, as I've said, kagina na arap lang ko sa eighty percent. But I feel like in I still have two months to work with the other twenty percent to make it a hundred. To show everyone, I really deserve the crown because I'm just not really all about the beauty physically, but I have so much to share with 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 the world, especially with um, especially with my advocacy that I really want to share to the people and the environmental sustainability that I've been working so hard ever since when I was in college. So I have really that genuine advocacy, and I can share it to people with my with my with my capabilities and with my technical knowledge on it. So that really inspires me na I can really do this. And um, I feel like that's like the only wish I want back back home. Na tani, uh, they're, 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 they're gonna keep on uh, supporting me and showing their support through cheering me up. At times na I, I don't feel like my best now because I'm still I'm still a human. I feel sometimes low no, about myself. I don't feel that much confident or I feel like I did not do much. So, um, gaka emotional at times. But every time I see like uh, anyone commenting so positive or like cheering me up in the comments, so, parang ginana yung ginana lift yung mood ko and ginana inspire na to really do better. So, uh, support. <laughs> appreciate yourself yeah, first. So, yeah, gabi gidi sir ang effect actually sa social media. No? I appreciate I appreciate yourself yeah. first. Pabayin na yang uh, pabayin na lang social media. I appreciate yourself first. Everything will follow, no? Uh, the supports okay. of uh, the Gimaras Nons will be there. And it's not just Gimaras Nons. Uh, the support of uh, the province and city of Iloilo will be there because they really don't care. Uh, kung sino ka muda, 
ang ilang lang niya nga dapat taga dream alin no and uh, ara gina ya so but uh, you know at the end of the day ara na sa imo tanan so you have to appreciate yourself first first things first ikaw gid anay kay everything will follow na lang masunod gina sila sa imo Vanessa Yeah, that's right, Sir Rod. Actually, I appreciate it ano, because I just realized that yeah, everything really needs to start from within, like with me. And I am going to improve my life. I feel like uh, I feel more beautiful right now. I feel that I could like offer so much already. Hindi not going to be able to Yeah. <laughs> damo sang na damo sang na dalin as hotik o kakadlaw ang isa ho. Hindi yeah. <laughs> mamati sa hotik. It should be yourself. No, when you decide it should be yourself. Uh, when you think you are when, when you believe you're beautiful, katulog ko siya to. You it should be yourself, no? Uh, everything else will follow na lang. Basta ang rule number one, halin di sa niya sa IMT, hindi mamati sa hotik. Damo gisa nga kakadisgrasya sa hutik. Moving forward, uh, we are excited uh, sa pag... Uh, I know nga hindi na ni namon makakuha ang amuning opportunity in the coming days. Nga may istorya ka namon liwat. Uh, medyo malawig-lawig yun eh. Because sako na ang schedule. We are very thankful on behalf of IMT News nga nagpakigupod uh, ka sa amon subong. And the message na gusto mo ipalapot sa mga pumuluyo sa Western Visayas, labi kaglabaw sa tanan, diri sa amon sa Iloilo, kag sa probinsya sa Gimaras. So to everyone, to the Gimaras Nons and mga Ilonggos, please support us, no? um, the candidates of this universe, especially sa Iloilo City, man, no? kag sa, um, sa Gimaras, because you also have your representative. But amo na, so support yet, and we have upcoming uh, mga activities, no? we'll be uh, we'll be in Itbulaga on Saturday, so uh, it's nice if you could like watch and uh, batayan nyo kami dira. Um, And then, um, with the next activities, no, you can always follow the official Miss Universe uh, Philippines page so that we'll be updated with the um, events, no, of the upcoming events and with our pictures, mga shoots, no, will also be there. And also, you can follow me on my personal uh, Facebook account and Instagram, Vanessa Wing, and in Instagram, it's Vanessa Chu. But I also have my uh, official page, na Vanessa Chia Wing. So you can always follow those uh, social media accounts so that you will be um, notified or you will be informed with the activities of Miss Universe uh, Philippines and also you'll be able to witness my journey. All right, Miss Vanessa Chiwing, the Miss Universe Philippines Gimaras. And ato na subong sa Metro Manila for the pre-pageant leading to the May 13th um, finals day, a pageant day. Kuto din kila lahon kung sino. And uh, we wish you well, and uh, we are praying for you. We're not just rooting for you. Uh, remember, you are not just carrying the name and the province of Gimaras. You are carrying the name of every Ilonggo from Region 6. So I hope you get the crown. Good luck and God bless, Vanessa. Thank you so much, Sir Rod, and to everyone. And also, I want to greet everyone. Happy International Women's Day to all the lovely and phenomenal women out there. All right. Si Miss Vanessa Chewing, kandidata sa pagka Miss Universe, representing the province of Gimaras. My name is Rod Texon, and this is IMT Conversations on IMT News. IMT Conversations with Rod Texon. Rod Texon. An incisive and sharp discussion of today's current issues. Ang pagpadayon sa duwa ka dekada ng serbisyo publiko. IMT Conversations with Rod Texon.